hello guys welcome back to my channel happy sunday i hope you're all really well so that's another week of budgeting done for me and that has taken us from monday the 12th up to today which is sunday the 18th of february this month is absolutely flying past for me i don't know how it is going for you guys uh what have i spent this week right my highest spend day was 18 pound 37 and my lowest spend day was nine pounds 11 all the other days fluctuated between those two amounts so the total that I spent on food shopping this week was £73.18. That's actually quite high for me. But I did have to buy a few bits like um, some spices and some condiments and things like that. So I was running low. Um, but at least I'm nicely restocked with them now. Um, so that's all my change left over on the table. I've also got my £20 in there from the dog walking that I do. And I sold a couple of bits on eBay. And I made £31.90. So I just withdrew the £30 and left the odd £1.90 in my bank. So the £30 in there as well. And we had our lovely date night. It was so nice. And as some of you know, I managed to save £150 for that. And we spent £91.84. And I thought that was brilliant for a three course meal for two people and drinks as well. So that left me with £58.16p left over. So I've added that in there as well. And I'll probably start my date night fund off again, probably the end of the month. Um, yeah, we enjoyed it so much that we thought, yeah, we'll definitely, definitely do it again. So, right, let's have a count up of notes. So I should have quite a bit this, this week with the eBay and all that. So, right, this week I've got, right, those seven envelopes are now empty, so I've put them to one side. So to go into the cash stuffing envelope this week, I've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. 150 pounds, that is brilliant. Um, and I have got some more bits as well to put on eBay and Vinted. So it's just finding the time to sit and do them all and, you know, get them uploaded. And Right, so let's have a count up and see what I've got so far. And we've still got over a week and a half to go, I think, till, um, yeah, the end of the month cash stuff. So this is looking really healthy. Right, so in total so far on day 18 is uh, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 92, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 305, 10, 15. 315 pounds that's brilliant i'm really really happy with that 315 pounds sometimes i've only got that amount um at the end of the month so still having a week and a half to go that is brilliant now i'm just going to pause you because i want to take some money out and pop a couple of coins into my new 40 envelope challenge so just bear with me and i'll be right back okay i've brought you in a little bit closer because um at the end of the month i'm never left with much change because i've already dropped it all and i'm left with uh, just the notes so i thought if i this week just pop a few coins into some of these little uh, pockets so one two three and four is done five and six is done i've sealed them off um so i'm going to put two pounds into the pocket seven and i'm going to put three pound into pocket eight and then at the end of the month i've just got to pop five pounds in each uh, notes and seal them up so they're nearly done um and i'm going to pop two pounds into window number window door pocket i don't know what to call them pockets they are like little pockets aren't they i'm going to pop two pound into pocket number 12 so i've just got to put a 10 pound note in there and then just seal them all off at the end of the month and i will add in notes as well at the end of the month just to really give it a good a good bump up so right that is that done for the 40 envelope um challenge i'm just going to count my coins now see what i've got to drop into my savings pots tonight right that's everything counted up and i've got 31 pound and 98 pence in change so couples can go in the copper jar five pence pieces can go in my little charity jar uh 50 peas how many of these have we got one two three four five six seven of these right okay so i'm just going to mark seven of my little sticky dots off right and that's those seven marked off of there i mean 750 peas doesn't sound a lot but it's three pounds and then they all add up don't they so let's get these dropped into 
for there. Uh, right, the pound coins, let's do these and then I'll do the two pounds. So one, two, three, four, five, six one pound coins, but then I have just um, put seven in there, haven't I? So, right, six one pound coins. So I'll just mark six of these off. And that is six marks off of there. So let's get the one pounds in. Nicely. I think as well, once this is completed, all the pound coins that are in there, I think I'll probably, yeah, put them in here because, yeah, what else am I going to do with them? Right, two pound new uh, chart. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten on the dot. That's a nice amount of two pound coins. I try not to use my two pound coins, you see, so any more that I get in my change is a bonus. I'm just going to mark ten off. And voila, that is 10 marked off of there. So let's get these into here. Right, that's that done. And I'm just going to do the 10 P's and 20 P's on a speed through video. Okay, that's me all done for tonight. That's my next seven envelopes ready for the week ahead. Um, and I'll be back next Sunday for another budgeting video as normal to see how I get on. Um, I'll upload a food video on Wednesday like I normally do. And if I ever do find some extra time between working and dog walking and housework and everything in between, then I'll definitely try here yeah, and do some more videos. So I hope you have a brilliant week and take care. Bye bye.